Well lads, what's the crack? Welcome back to another video. It's some Carol Black Gimbites. And today lads, we're going up to Turners again, second week in a row. You know, we're playing Limerick today. Um, going to be a great game. Obviously, Kenny lost out last time to Galway. And of course, Limerick didn't have a great Munster campaign. Yeah, but lads, in saying that, Limerick are still one of the dark horses. I predicted them to go very far this year. And um, look, I give Kenny every chance, obviously. But um, look, it's going to be another tough game. And it's Kenny's third, third game in 14 days or something like that. So... Look, hopefully it'll be a good game. We're getting to the video now, and uh, smash that like button if you, if you go on to enjoy this video. Subscribe if you're new, and uh, let's get into it, boys. Go on, the cats! Yeah, just stopped here up in the horse and jockey leg just to get a bit of some tea and um, look lads, the rain is back again but sure what can you do, you know our summer was good, hopefully we'll be back soon and uh, look, there's a few Limerick lads in there, a few Kenny people in there so uh, get some tea, head up to the tortoise, go on the cats. <laughs> Just right here in Tardis. Um Look, the mat, like, as I said, right, the river is it's west, but I think the pitch will be obviously going to be slip today. Yeah. Well, look, uh, I think Colin Fenley starts. There's three changes. Colin Fenley starts for Kilkenny. That's, that's a big kind of good for Kilkenny. And look, Limerick obviously they're a very strong, very good team. Kyle Hayes, Keane Lynch, all them, you know, um, Hegarty, I think. It's, yeah, I think it's going to be very tight. I know you can, I can see another draw happening today, but um, look, hopefully the weather won't affect the players too much. It might open up as as the game goes on, you know, the weather like it might get a bit sunny again, who knows. So we're gonna go into the stadium now. Go on the cats. Yeah, the atmosphere is really starting to build here and um, look, uh, still rain of course, like I don't know how much it will affect the players but look, the Kenya tip or the Kenya Olympics are going out on the field and uh, hopefully they get game. Go on the cats. <laughs> Made a brilliant save, but um, for Kenny Richie Hope and, and James Mark, they both got three points to play each. And uh, you know, uh, Pat Ling is doing well, he came off for right for Liam Blanchard, but he's been doing well. So, look, three point game, it's not over yet, and uh, Kenny can't get back into it. They're playing well, and uh, won the cap.
Kenny Richie Bowman. Great play with Don Lonely. Daily by Taylor. Limerick win now by two points, 27 points to 122 now. Look, I thought with Richie Hogan got the goal, I thought it looked like, like they obviously showed they'd come back again, but look, Limerick were obviously the way better side on the day, you know, everything they got was going out of the barn. But look, this is when you ask yourself the question, like, is Kenny the team they were? And the answer is no. But like, look, will they win the Ireland tonight too? I, I don't think so, but look, um, again, this year has been more successful than last year. We, all, like, we won the league and no one gives a chance, but like, to be fair, like, and we got to the Leinster final, so look, it's been an improvement. I know these players are only new and everything, so we'll have to give them like a couple of years. And I don't think Limerick will win the All Ireland, I think Galway are the team to beat, so and they're playing Cork now, so what can do. Well, as we're just home there now. You know, obviously, a bit disappointed, a bit devastated without the All-Iron, but look, what can you do? Like, at the start of the year, people wouldn't have given us much of hope, but look, we won the league. A lot of people, we lost our first two games, a lot of people wouldn't have given us a hope, but we did it, you know. And same like when it came to the Leinster Championship, a lot of people wouldn't have given us much of hope, but again, we got to the Leinster final, we brought probably the All-Iron Championship this year to a replay, you know, we, we nearly had them. About like, the likes of Limerick, like they haven't won the All-Iron since 1973, like that's 45 years. I'm thinking about, like, I'm not that disappointed when I think about it like that because, like, a lot of Kilkenny people would take it for granted, but I've, like, like realised that we've gotten to so many learns over the years, so many finals, and, like, you know, this year, kind of, we kind of maybe may expected too much, you know what I mean? But, look, I hope Limerick go on fire, you know, they deserve to win today, um, look, will Kilkenny win all in a couple of years? I don't know, it's hard to see, but, so, lads, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe for more. And um, of course, that's the end of the Kilkenny Hurling vlogs for this year. Um, of course, I'll have more of the Waterford ones. And yeah, I just want to say thanks to everyone who subscribed to my channel and who liked it. And like, I'm really at 200 subs, I think. It's not a lot, but if I get there, that'd be great. So make sure to subscribe. And I also want to thank the Kilkenny GA and stuff like that for letting me do a lot of the match reports throughout the league and the Walsh Cup out on the pitch and stuff. You know, I appreciate it. You know, just doing match reports and just doing videos and stuff like that. So thanks to them. So, lads, thanks for watching. I'm going to up. Talk to you after, boys.